Okay, we need to try to wash this stuff off this truck. Need to add some water to it here in a little bit. It's got water, but I just want to put some more in it. Let's see if she'll start up. I haven't started this for a couple months. It's got a a uh, electric choke. With a uh, oh, she's low on gas too. I might go get some fuel. I may put some in it right now if I got some on the gas on the trailer. We're gonna put some gas in her. See my got an elbow on it. Alright guys, there's a no one set up. 21 inch Cubby Dead. 61 inch Ferris. 52 inch Grasshopper. 97 Chevy Silverado. 89 Chevy Bucket Truck I use for trimming trees. Today we're gonna run the 84. I don't remember what year it is. I think it's <clears throat> no, the 94. <coughs> 94 one ton with a low of scrap metal on it. We're gonna check this baby out and take it and uh, get her unloaded because we got the rock to go get with it. I'm at the drive through walking. I'm too early. It's not open yet. All right, we got the bank done. I like those edging. I think I know who did that, but I'm not sure. Looks pretty nice, though. So. Cruising down the road here on the way to the scrapper. The truck's running pretty good, I guess. I don't want to jinx myself. We'll see what it is when we get there. Right. Give you some advertisement.
bit more. I think that's good. Guys, got it. We don't care. Okay. Too bad you don't own this shop. Pretty nice little building. Oh yeah. Oh, here we go, right here. Yeah. Yeah. I was just adding a tiny bit more. Oh, there we're zeroed out. All right. Four sixty. The 152 that's 367. Oh, I'm sorry, pull that down again when I say 467. Yeah. Okay. Are you talking to me? Not now. I just had to double check it. Yeah, 467. Yeah, 467. Yep, we're good. Steven Hopper number two ways. Hopper number two. <laughs> Do you call this Cleveland or West Line? Postally, it's uh, Cleveland. Yeah. But I like saying it's West I like West Line myself, too. Yeah. Once that welder looks like it might want to slide off there. Let's see, the first one is 467. This one here is going to be, maybe. You got the forklift weight, 513. Might take it easy, that welder is kind of slippery. 
I'm gonna stand on this side this time, out of your way. There you go. <laughs> I guess they just dump them out and they fill up these dumpsters and have a big truck come and get them. All to the, wherever they go to the smelt, smelter, I think they call it. They. That's filmable. <laughs> There goes the fastest motor I ever had. <laughs> That's the fastest motor I ever had in a car. Yep. Oh, come on, throw another pound in there. $6.99. Ah. That's the heaviest one yet. How's that say? We're just minus minus 150, you. right? You are yeah. now up to a five times. There you, there's your birthday bike. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think you're gonna be able to do it. Are we gonna do, yep, we're gonna lay it down there. Oh, if you turn this a little bit more, you're going to catch it with that blink. Pull that blinker. As long as nothing's touching the floor. Turn this a little bit more in that blinker or catch the... There, ah, that's close enough. Well, we can't let it hit the ground. 377. Yep. A little lighter than I thought. Yeah, me too. <laughs> I thought it would be close to five. But that thing ain't even, uh, this is barely over 200 pounds. The five dollar things to do. Yeah. Let's see what we got this time. Four six four eighty six. Four eighty six. Your your pencil guy's outside. <laughs> four eighty six. He works his butt off here. He actually probably works harder than he should here. <laughs> Two sixty six. All right. All we got left. What's going to do to your toe? I know. <laughs> you know, and it makes me wonder if the steel toes are doing me a favor or not. Well, I don't know. That ran on it might not. And you imagine? That's my YouTube channel. Two seventy nine. So that was the last swing, wasn't it? Yep. Okay. Well, Paul, I want to thank you for coming out and visiting us. As you can see, we're here for you, here for everybody. We take all scrap, electronics, ferrous, non ferrous, steel, copper, aluminum, brass. All your appliances, make sure compressors are out. But, hey, appreciate it. Yep, all right, thank you. <laughs> oh, we are located three and a half miles south of Cleveland at the corner of 2 and D Highway. So if you know where Bauer Storage is, if you're familiar with the area, we're right on top of the hill. All right, Cleveland, Missouri. Thank you. All right, guys, 2,200 pounds. Good guys, glad I met them. Now we're on our way to get some rock for the next job. So, finally got this truck unloaded though. It's been loaded for a month, or better, maybe a little over a month. So, we'll uh, see you at the uh, rock place. Get some gravel, some decorative rock. <laughs>